Oh, hello, hello. Hello, boys. Um, it is so good to be able to talk to you. Um, and I know it's not face to face and I know it's not over video chat, but I think it's much better than a letter or an email simply because you can hear, you can hear my voice and you can see my face. Um, and I think that just makes it a little bit nicer. Um, I wanted to first up congratulate you both for your um, accomplishments this year. Um, your mum was able to send me some photos and a little video from your awards and um, I'm just so proud of you both. So, so proud of you. Um, you've had such a difficult year and you were able to still, still keep up with all of your school and, um, and still goes to Boys Brigade and, and, and you know, still achieve so much. Um, and with or without those achievements, I'm so proud of you, but like, I am in awe. I'm in awe of um, your determination and um, oh, I'm just in awe of both of you. In awe of both of you. <laughs> Sorry, I get my words muddled up a little bit sometimes. Um, but yeah, I just thought it was so important for you to know that even though I wasn't there, um, I was absolutely cheering you on from afar. Um, and I'm just, I'm so, so proud of you. Um, one thing that I wanted to do today is um, I wanted to show you a little bit um, around my house um, because there is, there is a chance that you'll be coming to visit me at some point, um, whether it's a month or, or whenever it is, um, I assume at some point <laughs> you'll see my house. And even if you don't come to see it in person, at least you can, you can have an idea of where I am and where Henry is. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd give you a little tour. Um, so we're in the lounge room at the moment. So I'll do a little, I'll do a little rotation. Ready? <laughs> uh, don't mind my sound effects. I'm just being a little bit silly. Um, but first off, the big thing in this room, the fish tank. It's one of mine and Ryan's favorite spaces to be. Um, and you've got, this is little Val. Val is the star of the fish tank. She is absolutely beautiful. And then you've got all these little guys. Now, Ryan is really good at remembering all the names. I'm not so much. Um, we have very um, playfully called them the Borg because I believe that they do have Borg in their name. Um, but I'm not entirely sure what the other, other part of their name is. So that will be a Ryan question. But we have lots of beautiful plants in there. Both Ryan and I really love plants. <laughs> um, so this is our little balcony. We've got plants all in there and some cat grass at the bottom that is just a bit dying, which is a bit sad. But Henry's got lots and lots of cat grass just there. We've got a little barbecue. Um, we did some burgers last night. We made cheeseburgers, um, which is like, it's kind of like a healthy version of McDonald's. <laughs> um, so it was really nice. Um, and we've got a nice little space here, which I love to go when I'm feeling a little bit overwhelmed and I just need a little moment. So when you boys visit, you're more than welcome to use that space if you ever need it. Um, we've also got, we've got more plants here. <laughs> I'll try not to show you every plant we have. Um, we do have some fun little photos on the wall. As you can see, I haven't quite finished it, <laughs> um, but we are getting there. So we've got these photo frames that we got uh, and the, that one, there you go. Um, those are both from Ikea. One says the herb garden and one says the vegetable garden. Um, and then I've got a little of the Winnie the Pooh because um, I think you both know I really like Winnie the Pooh. Um, <laughs> we've both got um, we've both got to do a little bit more work to fill out the frames and we've got little other bits and bobs. It's kind of hard to, to point in the video. It makes it a little bit tricky. Um, but anyway, so that's a work in progress <laughs> is all I wanted to say. Um, one of my favourite favorite spots in the entire lounge room and I think you boys will like it as well is this bean bag it is so comfortable I spend a lot of time here some days I don't feel very well so I sit here and I do some things on my phone um sometimes I play little games and watch a little bit of tv um yeah so I enjoy myself even though it's not quite quite what I had pictured um, <laughs> in um in terms of life, um, it's it's nice. There's air con, so I, I'm pretty happy. <laughs> um, and there's lots of things to look at that are nice in the lounge room. Of course, I spend a lot of time here, so um, I, I like to make it pretty. <laughs> so we've done, this is Ryan and I together. We decorate together. So we make all of the choices together, which is really nice. Um, we've got lots of plants. We've got a fern and a little monstera. Well, I think that's called a monstera. It's like a tiny monstera. I think it has a different name, but anyway. Um, of course, a Rubik's Cube. Now, I don't know if you boys know how to do a Rubik's Cube, but if you do, you should really teach me because I have no clue. I've been meaning to teach myself. 
Um, now, Ryan's really into butterflies, and I think they're beautiful as well. So for his birthday, I got him this little butterfly. It's much, much more pretty in real life. Um, and we have, oh, sorry, I'm a bit out of breath. Um, we have butterfly here, butterfly here, and another butterfly here. And then this is the periodic table. Um, that's a little gift I got for Ryan for his last birthday. <laughs> and we've got some records and a record player. So I really like those. Um, I love to listen to music. And we've, of course, sorry. And of course, we've got a lot, a lot of music because I, I am a musician after all. Um, so here's all of the music and all of the DVDs that we have. Those are just my favorites because a lot of the time we just watch Netflix these days or there's Stan or we have Disney Plus. Um, I'm not certain what you guys like to watch or what you're even like allowed to watch. Um, so feel free to give me a little list and I can make sure that that's what you watch when you're, when you're over. Um, just so everybody's happy. Um, and I'm sure if there's nothing on those things, then we can go on YouTube or you can bring DVDs over, etc. I'm sure we'll work out something. Um, we also have some games. Now, Matthew, I bought this chess set <laughs> for us to play with such a long time ago when you first got into chess. Um, and it's been sitting there waiting ever since, and that is okay. <laughs> it will get used. I, I use it a couple of times too. Ryan and I do like to play chess on the very infrequent occasion. Neither of us are very good. I'm sure you're much better than, than me now um, compared to last year when we played. Um, we also have Catan and he has a Catan expansion pack. Um, there's a couple other games in there that you might like so you know. There's some games in there that we might not play and that's okay. Oh, we also have some puzzles, so lots of puzzles for us to do. Um, there are some books, but I don't suspect you'll get around to reading books and things like that while you're here. But that's the activity covered. Um, what else? Um, now this is my room. We probably won't spend an awful lot of time in my room. Um, this will be more for space for Ryan to go um, when we're doing stuff. Um, and just so that we can, um, we can all have lots of space when we need it. Um, but I do want to show you one thing in here. This is a relatively new purchase. I would like you to meet Alfalfa. He is so soft. He is what's called a Squishmallow. I'm sure that you've heard of Squishmallows before. But if you haven't, they're all the rage in the autism community because they are just so soft. I cannot begin to describe to you how soft this is. Um, so yes, I have dubbed him Alfalfa. So he goes on my bed, but I am welcome to loan him to you or either of you while you're here. <laughs> um, and of course we have lots of plants, lots and lots of plants. Um, I've got my music things set up. Um, and if you want to play these, you're welcome to come in. Um, if either of you boys want to do music lessons, I'd be happy to do that while you're here as well. Um, I've also got some photos of you guys. So there's the photo, ooh, there's the photo of us at my graduation. Um, and this is a photo with grandma recently. Isn't she beautiful? Um, and then, oh, who, do I, who else do we have here? Oh, and this is your beautiful cousin, Poppy. She's so lovely. She's, um, she's very playful. <laughs> Um, I'm sure she'd love to meet you one day. Um, and then we've got Henry's big tower, big scratching post. Um, he really loves that, but he also likes to play and be naughty and he likes to bump this all the time, <laughs> especially when I'm sleeping and I'm not feeling well. <laughs> He's so silly. Um, so I hope I'm not boring you, by the way. I do realize this is a bit of a long video. Um, now this, this is the toilet, same old, same old. It's, it's nothing, nothing interesting. <laughs> we do have some plants on the windowsill. Of course, it's me, I love plants. Um, and this is our bathroom. We do have a bathtub, which I thought would be really nice for you guys to have a little bath if you wanted. I know Jonathan, you probably enjoy baths more than Matthew, but I don't know, Matthew, I, I have baths all the time. So <laughs> I know that ev everybody on an occasion likes a bath. So it's welcome for you if you ever wanna use it. Um, now this, this is the spare room. And at the moment it's got this, oh, I can see there's a little honey. Hi, baby. Oh, there we go. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> He's so beautiful. I could pat him all day. And quite often I do. Um, we of course got more plants in here, more plants over there, a little TV in here. Um, this is more of a like rest room at the moment. Like just like a little separate section that like Ryan and I could go to if we ever want a little bit of space. Um, but what I was thinking, um, if you do come over to visit, 
I know that we do have two mattresses that can go here and it would be all fine, plenty of space. But what I was thinking is that if you do end up coming over just a little bit more frequently, I was thinking maybe I could get some bunk beds to have in here for you guys. So you have your very own room um, when you come here. And of course we could pop some toys in the cupboards and there'd be plenty of place for clothes. You wouldn't have to bring those over all the time. Um, but it really depends on just like what happens. But I just wanted to let you know what might happen. Um, just because I, I struggle when I don't have a plan in mind and I thought maybe that might, might help you guys too. Um, last room, I have the kitchen. <laughs> Now, we do have a harness for Henry, so we could take him for walks together, which I thought would be really cool. Um, another thing that we could do in here is we could do some baking. Um, we have a bread maker, so we can do fresh bread, which is really, really delicious. I had some for breakfast. Um, we've got some healthy fruit, of course. And then in the fridge, in the fridge, we have some goodies. <laughs> now, I can't remember which one of you likes pickles. I think it's both, but... If I'm wrong, I take it back. But we've got pickles all the time because pickles are my favorite. Um, and also, we also have some olives. So I will always have a little supply of olives for you because I know that you both like olives. Um, and just let me know what snacks that you like because I can pop them in the fridge for you for when you come. Um, we do have some like healthy things as well. Um, and oh, what's I do? <laughs> I didn't put the lemon juice back. Silly me. There we go. That's better. Um, huge fridge. Can fit so many things. Um, we also have a really, really big pantry. So plenty of space for snacks. So snacks usually go up here. I have a bunch of different options for snacks. Um, I also have marshmallows. Um, and Jonathan, I know that you love marshmallows. And Matthew, I'm sure you love marshmallows too. Who doesn't love marshmallows <laughs> and then we've also got like crackers and things like that and we've got some popcorn we could pop um and yeah this is where all the snacks go but i'm happy to get whatever snacks that you like um and pop them in there as well but yeah i'm fairly certain that is the end of the tour i think that that is it but yeah i really hope that you've liked it um but yeah yeah i think that's literally all i have to say um i love you both very much um, I hope you have enjoyed my tour <laughs> as guided by your sister, Crystal. <laughs> and I hope to hear from you soon. Um, of course, I would love to see a video response from you both because, as I said, it's just really nice to hear your voice and um, see your beautiful faces. But I do understand, Matthew, that you, you might not be willing to do that. And that is so okay. I don't want you to do anything that you don't want to do and that you're not comfortable with doing. I want to see you, but I, I want to big word, minimize <laughs> um, the amount of discomfort that you get from it because I, I do know that you struggle with those kinds of things. Um, and Jonathan, I hear that you love the videos. So of course, I'll keep doing them for you as well. But uh, yeah, it's just really nice to see. So, uh, obviously, I'm not seeing you, but it's really nice to feel like I'm chatting with you. <laughs> and I hope to do some more soon. Um, I love you both very much. And I think that's all for me. Mwah. Mwah. Mwah.